so we can go further now what you want to do is connect your phone to the computer and you wanna open up your phone's memory and copy this application on the root of your device's memory I will leave a link in the description with this application so just hit copy and paste it to the root of your device's memory now you can close this window and this one too so what you want to do next is install sidesync I will leave a link in the description with sidesync too you want to make sure it is on on the computer and uh, with Samsung sidesync on just connect your device again to the computer and the window will pop up just like that now select galaxy apps you can now disconnect the device if you want to hit agree and it will throw you to this window you don't want to install sightseeing just hit search you want to download and install a file manager this is just good so hit download now uh, you have to create a Samsung account or you can sign in if you already have one I will just sign in because I have one I will enter my ID and password So, after we have signed it in, hit accept and download, and it will um, automatically install the application on your device. You can click on the app.
I will try to install another program. This is take, this is taking too long to install. I will just restart the phone. So I will connect it again with the PC. Hit search, file explorer, hit download again. And hope this time it will install it faster. Normally it should take about a minute or so. So there you go. Now click on the app and click open. So now you're inside the phone's memory. Install the app you just put it there. Click settings. Let unknown sources install the app. Click install. And hit open. Now what you want to do is go to applications and search for the settings app. And then hit try. Now you're in settings. Click 
about device hit build number a few times until you are a developer if, you, if this doesn't work just go back go back one more time hit activities and now what you want to do is search for Google For Google Account Manager, this one over here. And now you want to click here where it says type email and password. And you hit try. Now in this window, you can see three dots over here. Click the three dots and then Click browser sign in. Okay. And uh, from here, you can enter whatever Google account you want. I have an account that I own, so I will just enter it. Hit next. Now type in your password. And hit sign in. After that, you want to restart your device. So just enter whatever Google account you know its password. So you can see your account is added, click next, next, I don't want to restore from backup, done, next, skip, yes, skip anyway. now you're in if you want you can now delete your account that you just put in 
and you can create another one or you can just use your phone like that whatever you like